What's up guys? So today in this video, I'm going to be going through three e-signature automation platforms. So this is with an API. So e-signature automation, not just e-signatures. And all of these, you can create docs. You can request from multiple senders. You can just request from one sender. You can have custom fields, custom docs, all of that. You can do all of that in these three, but I'm going to go through the, some of the benefits that I've found with each one. And so if you're interested in that, stick around. But if you haven't met me before, my name is Ben Green. I'm the owner of Optimize IS. What we do is we help business owners probably just like you help them optimize their information systems. So that's doing a lot of database development. So what would happen before the e-signature is sent, uh, aggregating that data really nicely in a database, as well as the workflow automation around like maybe coming from Airtable to e-signatures to letting you know that it's sent, letting you know that it got uh, signed, delivered, opened, all of that stuff. We do a lot of that workflow automation to save you time and so you don't have to figure out how to set it up. So if you're interested in any services, you can check out the link in the description and request a consultation from me or someone on my team. But without further ado, we'll get right in the video now. So one of the most popular products on the market is DocuSign and it's very easy to use. It's very popular. Even the non-API plans are probably the most popular, but also their pricing is right in the middle. So their pricing comes in... Uh, depending on which plane you're going with at $50 per month, $300 per month, or $480 per month. Um, and that's, that's different than their regular pricing. So this is to get the advanced features, the API. It's still, it can be all no code. You do have to know a little bit about how to set it up, but these are no code platforms that allow you to, like you onboard someone and it automatically sends them your NDA or automatically sends them your independent contractor agreement. All of that can just be simply automated or especially for real estate agents, you can automate a lot of your contracts out of something, out of any of these three. So that is something that this is included, or that is something that is included in this. And so something you might want to note here is like at the $50 per month plan, you get 40 envelopes per month. So that comes out to a dollar 25 per envelope. And so as you go up, it becomes cheaper and cheaper, but it does go up from 50 to 300 to 480. So for the very basic plan, it again is $1.25 per envelope per signature that you get. So now we're gonna go to HelloSign. HelloSign I would say is like the second runner. Um, it is a little bit more expensive for the API plan, but you do get a lot of benefits. So with DocuSign and HelloSign, they're very developed. They're meant for that like really custom feel in the signature platform. Um, but like they, they really, you can make some really custom docs, do a lot of really cool things with that. Uh, but all of these, they can really pull in most of the same information. I know like DocuSign has like power forms and HelloSign has another, has a whole like other suite of features. But just for the API automation itself, these are all very similar up to this point. So for HelloSign for the API pricing, it's $99 a month. And so with that, you get 50 e-signature requests. So if you saw at DocuSign, you get, for $50, you get 40. And so here it's, for DocuSign, it's $1.25 a pop. For HelloSign, it's $2 a pop. So you can see it's a slight increase, but you do, HelloSign is a fan favorite for those who really value customizability. Uh, really making your documents pretty, making the experience work like super pretty. Um, with that being said, with the higher price for those of you who are just trying to get in the door, get started with this, a hundred dollars a month might be pretty scary. So I probably wouldn't go with this one if it was between DocuSign and HelloSign. DocuSign is just cheaper and you, it's not as much per month. You can do less um, at a lower price and you still have unlimited templates. Uh, basic fields and all of this that you really need to just get started with e-signature automation. Now the third one, which I think gets the biggest bang for the buck is e-signatures.io. Now with like these e-signature automation requests, DocuSign and HelloSign, they really have it down for a very like personalized, super, super highly branded but you can still have that in e-signatures. You can still have all of the custom fields, have all of really everything else. But if you see on the screen here, I mean, it kind of pops off, but 49 cents per contract sent. So that's a huge decrease from 
Hello Signs two dollars per envelope, and Docu Signs a dollar twenty five, and you still get like with all of these, you're gonna get the legality of it. So they're gonna be legally binding contracts, and they really, I think they all like when somebody opens it from their email, then it knows it's them, and if they don't open it from their email, then they have to go like authenticate it with their email. So so there's a lot of really good stuff for all three of these for making sure that e-signature is legally binding, but that de doesn't differentiate any of these in my eyes. So all of these are the same. Um, for the features, I would say, unless you really, really value the customizability, the person personalization, the difference between HelloSign, DocuSign, and e-signatures, I would say, is HelloSign and DocuSign were built for the customer experience, for you being able to sign it really easy, and all of that, whereas e-signatures is built, I believe, as an API platform. So they want the automation, they want people to come in because it's cheap and you can automate it super fast. And what it's set up really similar to making templates in Google Docs. So as long as you like can understand how to make a Google Doc, it is essentially the same as doing that in here with Zapier or um, I'm not sure how much they connect with Integra Mount, but I know they have all three of these have a really slick integration with Zapier. So that's definitely like the easiest place to get started. You don't have to do any like custom coding, custom anything. You just know how to place custom fields and pull from your database that you build on the back end. So regardless of all three, all three of these that work really well, I've seen some really custom, really, really custom stuff built on HelloSign, uh, sending it to multiple senders, sending it to one sender, pulling in custom contract data from a database that can all happen with any of these three. So you can, like the, the sky is the limit with any of these. Uh, one thing I would note again is if you are in one of these plans here, if you only use one of these per month, you're still paying $99. Whereas if you only use one in eSignatures.io, you're at half a dollar. So that's something to consider and that goes for both HelloSign and DocuSign. But if you're curious about eSignatures.io and you want to learn how to create a simple template in eSignatures.io, you can go check out the end screen right here. If you want something like this built for you and your business, you don't have to figure out or contemplate the plans. You can request a consultation. We can talk about the different plans for each for the API pricing, as well as getting you set up so you don't have to be manually requesting e-signatures and all of that. So request a consultation if you want, but go check out this end screen right here and you'll learn all about creating that template in e-signatures.io. Uh, all in that video, everything you need is there. So I'll see you there and have a great day.